The, the sound is awesome. Love what you guys are doing. Everyone, thank you for uh, for tuning in today. Uh, my name is Danny Kay. I am a, uh, a great patron of the Nagra family, and of course, super excited to uh, to be here with their 70th anniversary. Uh, that they're launching some special products this year. Uh, I actually uh, I've been in high end audio for the last uh, 20 22 years, writing for a couple of magazines in uh, Europe and in America. And just recently, last year, I launched my own YouTube channel. Who would have thought about that? And so I talk about, you know, hi-fi records, music, and really the, 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 the commonality that it's all about the music, right? And so, uh, you know, I, I've known Nagra for, for a long time, and they graciously asked me if I uh, would come in and spin some records and, you know, again, sort of rekindle the music in, uh, in, in high-end audio and spin music that's maybe not, prevalent in typical audio demonstrations. So I, I picked up some, uh, some tracks from the Yugoslav jazz scene, the Yugoslav prog rock scene, uh, played some UB40, which was really kind of neat. And, you know, people had a great time. Uh, you know, it's, it's a fantastic system, of course. You know, it's, it's got the entire Nagra HD line uh, with, of course, the, the uh, awesome uh, Nagra 4S tape machine. Uh, it has a new 70th anniversary turntable, which is exceptional. And, uh, of course, uh, Wilson Audio XVX loudspeakers. And, you know, I'm obviously great friends with the Wilson family. Uh, it's been fantastic. Uh, you know, the, the sound is awesome. Love what you guys are doing. Uh, thanks for, uh, if you're tuning into my channel, Sonic Flare, uh, great seeing you guys. And also start checking me out very soon at The Absolute Sound, uh, where I will be covering uh, official videos for The Absolute Sound here from uh, Europe. My, my first encounter with music, uh, actually my brother, 10 years my age, uh, took me to a hi-fi show in Vienna, so I, I grew up in Austria. And this was, I want to say, like 1980, 81. And, you know, I was a little kid walking into the, the showroom floors, Technics, Yamaha, Revox, and, you know, just all the meters bouncing and music playing Michael Jackson. And I, I forgot what it was. Um, wait, I think it was Michael Jackson, uh, uh, Thriller just came. So it was 82. It was 82. Uh, Thriller just came out. And it was just like, wow, right? I mean, it was just an awesome experience. I was like, you know, I want this, I want this. And of course, yeah, I, I didn't, you know, get a, a big system. I had a little cassette deck uh, that my brother got me. Uh, and I, I started making lots of demo cassettes and, you know, like everyone else did back in the 80s. And yeah, that was, uh, that was my gateway drug uh, to get into the high-end audio. And then, of course, you know, I was a, a poor schlub out of college. Uh, didn't really have much money, but uh, I, I, you know, I'm gifted with being able to make great friends, or so I think. And so I started hanging out at hi-fi shows and, and hi-fi showrooms and, you know, playing music when I could. And uh, then in 2000, uh, I joined Positive Feedback. Uh, you can, of course, check them out. They're, they're, they're online, a great publication. And they were like, hey, we're looking for young writers uh, would you be interested in writing for us? And uh, I was like, uh, okay. I mean, I guess I've never done it before, but why not? Let's give it a shot. And so that's my uh, that's my that was my introduction to high end audio and hi fi and music and everything else.